A dial requires focus. Art Noctua said the same. Do I... It may take practice to solve it. That didn't sound good. Salazar Slytherin didn't make this easy. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. We are going to be trying to do as many of the side content that we currently have available right now. Because I do want to get those out of the way, get that all cleared up. And that was, that will be what we'll be doing. So we have a lot of side content. We have, I count, seven missions that we have to do that is all side content right now. Before we continue on with the main story, I'm going to try to get that all done in this episode. That way we are, well... Obviously, there's ones that I just can't do, like this one where I have to collect nine of these. I won't be able to do those as quickly unless I happen to be finding them while we're doing all the other missions. But yeah, that's the plan on this one. So thanks again for the support as always. Here we go. Enjoy. Let's see what this one has to offer. So to start off, we'll be doing In the Shadow of the Blood, blah, 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 blah. In the shadow of the bloodline. Yes. Let's track this. <laughs> hey, it's Halloween. It's all the pumpkins. Wow, that's cool how they have the pumpkins out to celebrate Halloween. It tells you when, where we are at in terms of timing. Hey, it's me. No, Gareth. You have a moment. We're in the Great Hall. That is very cool. All right. Anything to do with the Dark Heart should be avoided. It's too risky. Anything to do with Salazar Slytherin is worth the risk. I can't agree. And I'll not say a word more. I'm sorry. Can I speak to you? I won't give up. What were you and Omina speaking about? <laughs> what? He's being ridiculous. <laughs> what Apparently is he Salazar doing in the background? A secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. Omina swears it was used for the dark arts, so he wants nothing to do with it. I reminded him that Anne needs a cure. This scriptorium could hold the answers we need. The dark arts do pique my interest. There's more to dark magic than people realize. The Gaunts know this better than most. Perhaps I've spoken out of turn. Ominous's family history is personal to him. I understand. You needn't tell me if you don't want to. If I were you, I'd be begging for more details. It's none of my business. It's not that I'm not interested. And you can certainly trust me if you want to tell me anything. Ominous learned dark magic from his parents. Are you familiar with the Cruciatus Curse? I'm not. What does the Cruciatus Curse do? I don't it's remember known it. It's the Torture Curse. Oh, Cruciatus. torture. Yes, It inflicts yes. intense, excruciating pain on the victim. Apparently, his parents and older siblings had no qualms about casting it on muggles for sport. Ominous described the sound of the victim's cries as horrific. So the first time he was asked to cast it himself as a child, he couldn't bring himself to do it. As punishment, his family cast it on him. The anguish was so bad that when asked to cast it again, he relented. I have repeatedly assured Ominous that he did what he had to, but he still hasn't forgiven himself. How horrible. Poor Ominous. He was only a child. He shouldn't blame himself. After that incident, the rift between Ominous and his family only grew. That is until I came along. Every moment he isn't at Hogwarts, he's with us in Feldcroft. Ominous trusts me. And more often than not, he winds up listening to me. I'll remind him of that when I follow up about the Scriptorium. Watch for my owl. I'll have news soon enough. Okay. I'll make Ominous understand. He'll change his mind. Uh, was that all it was for this quest? Was that it? 
All right. Uh, the Lost Child. Meet Natty in Lower Hogsfield. Here, looking for Mr. Bickle. Very Wait. I pressed ominous regarding Salazar Slytherin Scriptorium, but my efforts were in vain. Meet me outside the Slytherin common room. We need to talk. All right. Well, first I'm gonna to talk to Natty. All right, and then I'll come back. Imagine how inconvenient. Is this Mr. Bickle's home? I believe so. He supposedly has evidence against Hallow. We need to speak with him. Okay. Why did he challenge? Are you all right? We're looking for Mr. Bickle. My husband is dead. He killed him. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mrs. Bickle. Who killed your husband? Theophilus Harlow. I'm sure of it. He's been threatening my husband for weeks and... Oh, where is my son? Where is Archie? I don't mean to be grim, but could Harlow have taken him? Archie's satchel is missing, so he may have left on his own. Hopefully he's just gone wandering, as he's prone to do. I hope he wasn't here when Harlow... When my husband... Do you know which way Archie might have gone? <laughs> um, he has a little hideout in the forest south of here. He never wanders far. But if he witnessed Harlow doing something to his father, uh, I'm afraid to leave in case he comes back home. All right, we have to find your son, Mrs. Bill. Yep. Thank you. <laughs> what am I going to do? Just stand there. I'll be back. <laughs> Please do not worry, Mrs. Bill. Where could Archie have gone? Uh, it's pretty close by, not that when far. When I took the letter we found to Officer Singer, she told me about Mr. Bickle. He had been doing the same thing we are, providing... Uh, one second, not Natty, I gotta sell stuff. Alright, find Archie's hideout. He is up here. What the heck? Something attacking the birds? What did Officer Singer say about the letter you brought her? She thanked me, but she clearly felt that it was not enough. It is a shame that hippogriffs cannot speak. Your friend Highwing could provide all the evidence against Hallow that we need. Revelio. We will need something more. This uh, is little Archie's hideout that Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Archie? That is took his money. Archie Bickle! He would not have done this to his own hideout. Someone came here looking for him. It's a dragon Maybe skeleton. Our only hope of finding out which way he went. Uh, I'm, I'm trying. There, Archie's footprints. He went oh. this way. Follow the footprints. I thought we would have found Archie by now. I suspect he'll keep running if he's being followed. If it is Harlow that's pursuing him, I only hope you're right. Men like Harlow would not think twice about killing a child. We must find Archie. Uh, where did they? Where did the footprints go? Wait, this way. Okay, I lost it for a second. Oh, buddy. Expelliarmus. I hope I didn't cross paths with that wolf pack. We should look around. Mongrel fur. All right. There's a satchel right here. I found it. Archie's satchel. Why would he leave it behind? He was likely running from Hollow, distracted. This may be a good time for Revelio. Revelio. He went this way. Archie went this way. I, I just said that. Stop copying me. I have a bad feeling about this. Hallow must have a reason for pursuing Archie. I wonder what Archie saw. What is this? 
I hope he didn't see Harlow kill his father. What does this symbol mean? At least not in any way I can imagine. Revelio. I don't know what that symbol means on the map. Got to come back later. Need Revelio again. Handy resource indeed. Multiple sets of footprints. Oh, Harlow caught up to him here. This is not good. They went this way. <sighs> what is that? Can I catch this? Wait. We caught it. Nice. Thestrals. They are beautiful, are they not? They are. I don't need to catch any more, though. Too. I witnessed death when I was nine. Saw my first Thestral shortly thereafter. I found comfort in it. Revelio. I, I think those of us who have witnessed death deserve some comfort. I'm sorry you experienced something like that at so young an age. I was with my father when he died. My mother was away, and I felt quite helpless. It was a long time ago in some ways, but in other ways, it seems like it was only yesterday. I still see him so clearly. You must miss him. My father was a wonderful man. I... Mm, let us keep moving. We must find Archie. Revelio. This way. Ooh, there's some poachers. Hit a rock. Wow, he dodged it. Arrest them and Oh, hey there. They got what they deserved. They did. There's a lot of stuff here. What is this? What is this? Arrest the momentum. Oh. 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 Looks like I just gotta match the symbols. I think that's the only thing I gotta do with this. Uh, flip it this way, right? A couple more times. And right, that one's done. There should be another one. Third one somewhere. Ooh, eggs. Can I capture? I have fiat. They have Archie. Be on your gut. Oh. There can be no mistakes. Oh, there's another one up here. Is it just three? If it's just three, this is easy. 
Flipendo. And then get it back up. Alright, nice. Taken care of. Very cool. Alright, uh, there is some stuff here. There's a chest here. Grab this. Cruelty 3. There's also a... thing up here. up on the other side. <sighs> Just somehow find a way. Ooh. Incendio. And up the ladder. There we go. Hundred experience. All right, let's get back to our objective that we were doing. So they are in here. Ashwinder tent. Oh, defeat enemy with this tent to be so large on the inside. That complicates things a little. This is a bigger tent than it looks like outside. Uh. Oh, there they are. All right, well, we can't go that way. We got to go this way. You don't uh, think he saw it happen, do you? He's no. just a child. Uh, kaboom. Let me get you, uh, assassin. the easier target probably, probably you way out here you scout <sighs> turn around somebody there. out there oh oh you're all going out what the heck? you all decided to go that way Katrin Haggerty. That's a boss. She doesn't have a level to her name. I'll get rid of you. That's a legendary chest piece. Nice try. Eat these crates. <laughs> All right. They did. They sure did. Uh, yes. Just one moment. Just one moment. 
I gotta loot whatever I can find in here. I got some money. Nothing else. Ah. Revelio. Some gloves. Uh, that's the stairs to go down. All right, yeah, we're coming. We're on our way down. Right here. We will free you. Archie. Archie Bickle. How do you know who I am? Your mother sent us to find you. Oh, let's Not too loud, Archie. Sorry. We need to get this open. Hello, Hamora. All right, I got this. There it is, and then... There we go! I'm Uncle Tarlo. He killed my father. We're so sorry, Archie. We won't let him get away with it. But first, we need to get you home to your mother. Thank you for saving me. We wouldn't have it any other way, Archie. Now let's get you home. We know a safe way back. All right. Oh, it's a good thing it mixes fast travel there. Oh, Archie, you're here. Oh, oh you're safe. Mother, oh, mother. Father's friends are in danger. I heard the people who took me talking about them. Which friends, darling? Mr. and Mrs. Rabe. Mr. Filbert. And I think they also said Otto's name. Oh. I shall speak with them. You run inside. Yes, Mother. Your husband's friends may be in danger. Just as he was. How can we help? You've done enough. My husband was a powerful wizard and couldn't defeat Harlow. The last thing we need is that monster coming after you. We don't want to worry you. I'm sorry again about your husband, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. And thank you for bringing Archie home. I can never repay the two of you for your kindness. Not to worry, Mrs. Bickle. My father used to say that rain does not fall on one roof alone. We are here to help each other. Okay. I must learn more about Mr. Bickle's friends and why Harlow is after them. You'll be hearing from me as soon as I Hey, can. level 22. Nice. Thank you for your help today. You're welcome. Off on another All right. What is next on the list? That's right. We have to go back and speak with Sebastian. Oh, we'll learn Crucio. All right. Uh, first, let's actually go to our room of requirement because I need to unveil what I currently have in my inventory. Because we got some legendary stuff. And I do love some legendary stuff. So the shirt is the best thing we got. I will take it. Alright. Let's go ahead and wait. You're here. Brilliant. I received your owl. What happened with Ominous? I told him none of us will be able to avoid dark magic forever. So the more we know about Salazar Slytherin and the dark arts, the better prepared we'll be. Unfortunately, only a Gaunt knows the location of the Scriptorium's entrance and Ominous won't tell me. Hmm. Perhaps I should have a chat with Ominous. You? I suppose it's worth a try. But don't get your hopes up. Ominous is annoyingly stubborn. Nothing new. I know where he is. I'll lead you to him and then leave you to it. Come on. He's this way. Uh, yep. Show me the way. Wow, so this is where Slytherin's side of the Hogwarts is. It's very Keep an eye out. dark and ominous. Never know who's watching. 
Although that hasn't stopped us before. Strictly speaking, it has. We were caught. Damned poltergeist. Such a nuisance. All right, which way, which way? Which way? Which way? Right. Okay. All right, straight? Nope, right. There he is. There he is. All right. Revelio. There's a chest here. Okay. Hold on, I just need to get this chest. I'm back. I'm back. See, look, I'm what safe. What are you doing here? Hello, Ominous. Do you have a moment? What is it? What have you and Sebastian been up to now? Please, Ominous. I confided in you before about what happened with the Undercroft. Sebastian simply wanted me to have a safe place to practice some spells, to try and catch up to the other fifth years. He didn't think you'd mind. <sighs> I suppose that makes sense. It's just Sebastian's been pestering me lately about something and I'm frustrated with him. Don't tell me he's still going on about, what was it, a scriptorium? He told you about that? He did. We were talking about Hogwarts founders and he mentioned it. Wouldn't say much more though. Yes, well, he seems to think it contains the answer to saving Anne. I think it's likely full of dark magic that is better left untouched. Wait, you've never been inside? Of course not. I only know about it because of my favorite aunt, Noctua. She thought like I do. Didn't agree with the family on the use of dark magic. In fact, she'd hoped to convince my family that there was more to Salazar Slytherin than worshipping pure blood status. She'd heard of this scriptorium and thought its contents might shed some light on him. She even found the secret entrance in this very corridor. She wrote regularly to my father about her efforts to gain access, and then she simply vanished. No one else ever tried to enter. Uh, are you curious? I'm sorry about your aunt. Don't you want to find out what happened to her? Aunt Noctua went down this path with good intentions and lost her life. I don't want the same to happen again. You don't know that history will repeat itself. Besides, you said your aunt thought like you. This could honor her memory, get you answers about Slytherin and Sebastian answers for Anne. Your aunt pursued this alone. We could do it together. Hmm. I see what you've done here, and I confess, you've convinced me. I didn't think it possible. Very well. I shall tell you what I know. Fetch Sebastian, I'll wait. I hope I... we don't Open regret. Slytherin's Sebastian, door. over here. These braziers grant access to the scriptorium. Now you'll share? Incendium! You'll tell me what I'm practically begged. It wasn't you who told me what I needed to hear. Opening the entrance has something to do with threes. Well, three so... heads are better than one. It's two heads are better than one. And by that logic, three is better than two. Am I just lighting these all on fire? Is that is that the goal? Oh, that is not the right way. Wait. Incendio! Wait a minute. Confringo. Something's happening. I hope we're ready for this. Uh. Uh. Let there be light. Lumos. Looks like a locked door. We may want to look around. Noctua Gaunt's note, one of five. I must prove my point. We do not need to use the dark arts as my family instructs. When I reach the scriptorium, I will find evidence that there's more to Salazar, Salazar Slytherin than we realize. A journal entry, signed by Noctua Gaunt. Oh, I know Gaunt. what to use here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Your family was here. Uh, Reparo. Reparo, I know. She was my aunt. The rubble formed a relief of a person facing a snake. Lumos! That must be the voice I hear. Oh, we're gonna be hearing some Slytherin ancient. talk. Sinister. You hear a voice? It started when you repaired that relief. I hear a whisper saying, speak to me. I'm a parcel mouth. 
I can hear and speak to snakes. Nearly all known parcel mouths are descended from Salazar Slytherin. I'd like to be able to talk to snakes. You might not want the ability to speak past the tongue. It's often associated with dark wizards. I haven't spoken it in ages, but I'd wager if I speak it now, the door will open. I'm hoping you're having second thoughts. Uh, second and third thoughts, none at all. I see no reason we should stop now. It's ironic. When I left home, I vowed to leave the dark arts behind, and yet here I am. Stand back. I can't believe I'm doing this. It worked! Ominous, you possess a rare ability indeed. Between the two of you, I'm starting to feel left out. Between the two of us? I... never mind. Lumos. There's no clear way forward. Like a maze. Salazar Slytherin most likely wanted this to be difficult to solve. The door we came from, it closed. And oh, more great. Ahead. Then look closely at each gate for clues. Well, first off, it's dark as heck in here. Ooh, this, this is open. The dial requires focus. Uh, not to have said the same. Do I... It may take practice to solve it. That didn't sound good. Salazar Slytherin didn't make this easy. Okay. Hey. Ah, uh, get off. Ah. Oh, Isn't it? Wait, a simple on that. Simple on that one is the top is that and then the snake. All right, hold on. So top one is this. Bottom one is the snake. There we go. I didn't realize that thing was actually doing damage to Matching me as well. Did open it. Lumos. I was about to do that myself, but you got to it first. <laughs> nice work. Uh, uh. Uh, okay. I failed the dial and it struck my face as if it was real serpent, but I must find a way forward for my family's sake. Ominous, your aunt wanted to change your family's traditions. She did, and she was my favorite person in the world. Good for you! Uh, what does this one open? I wonder if it opens the other door. There may be another door I'm missing. I'm not gonna touch that thing until I, uh... Until I know what the other door is needed to unlock. What is it? It's a... Oh, it's scraped, but I can kind of tell. It's like a cat and another symbol. What is in here? Salazar Slytherin buried this scriptorium deep within Hogwarts. I'm afraid I shall lose my way around these dark quarters. I am a descendant, and yet I feel unwelcome. This journal entry, it mentions getting lost and being unwelcome. Confringo! Poor Aunt Noctua. Lumos! Wait, so maybe it's this one? Alright, so this one here is writing, or like a Angle or triangle of some kind, and then like a cat on the top. Let's try this. Another gate. Cat on the top. There it is. And then right angle. Look in the mirror, Sebastian. All right, so that opens that door. Luma. Did. Another dial solved. There's another one back there, though. Extraordinary, this journey is painful but rewarding. I shall soon find the scriptorium and discover untold secrets regarding our house founder. Tended more than what we've become, I know it. 
Noctua references painful and arduous challenges, but also rewards. Painful. That's the part I'm wary of. I will definitely wear those gloves. I'll take it. Yes, plus 15. All I heard was rewards. Revelio, keep going. Lumos. Got more to solve ahead. Search each corridor. It's uh, this one is which leads where? a mountain and a duck face. Duck face up top, mountain on the bottom. Another, not the welcoming sort, was he? Duck face. There we go. Excellent work. We're another step closer to the scriptorium. Lumos. I spotted something ahead. Looks troubling. This whole place is troubling, but for my aunt's sake, we cannot stop this, it. This looks... The gate! It says Crucio on it. Again! Then Salazar Slytherin is not yet finished with us. Crucio. Find a way through. Okay. I've lost hope. I'm locked in. I heard a scream and saw the tortured faces. The only way forward is with an unforgivable curse. Even if I wanted to cast it, I have no one on whom to do so. Salazar Slytherin created a malicious challenge indeed. In my last correspondence to my brother, I'd invited him here. Now, if he looks for me alone, I'll have led him to his death. Despite our differences, I wish him no ill. I wish we had parted on better terms. So we're trapped in this room, but the only way to get out is to... Oh my gosh. Ominous. A skeleton. And Noctua's last journal entry. She mentions being trapped here, blocked by an unforgivable curse. This is where she died. This is where we'll die. I shouldn't have listened to either of you. Ominous, I'm truly sorry about your aunt. But I know what to do. It's going to be difficult. You said you know what to do. Tortured faces on the door and Crucio's etched into the stone. My guess is if we cast the Cruciatus Curse, the door will open. That's why Noctua died. She had no one to cast the curse on. Ominous has the most experience with this. He should cast it. You seem to be in Ominous's favor. Will you ask him about this? Uh, yeah. He I'll, does I'll seem take a the blow. With you. I'll speak with him. Good. Work your magic, so to speak. Wish we had some liquid luck. All of this could have been avoided. Lumos. Ominous. I hadn't imagined we'd end up trapped like this. Salazar Slytherin did. He's to blame for many unimaginable things. I overheard you and Sebastian, and I won't do it. The Cruciatus Curse is pure torture, I would know. Sebastian told me a little of what happened when you were young. Sounds as if you had no choice. <sighs> Should have known he would have told you. And one always has a choice. I'm as guilty as the worst of my family. Unforgivable curses won't work unless you really mean them. I had to want to cause pain, and for that I shall never forgive myself. That spells the reason I have no family left. You and Sebastian will need to sort out another solution. If you cast Crucio, you will regret it forever. All right, Sebastian, I tried. It didn't work. What do we do now? Ominous is not going to cast the Cruciatus Curse again. Ridiculous. As if dying in here is a better option than casting a damned spell. <sighs> it's up to us. I can teach you Crucio, or I can cast it on you. Wait, you didn't say you knew how to cast Crucio. Because I'm not sure I do. Ominous knows that, yet he's left us no choice. I don't yearn to follow in Noctua Gaunt's footsteps. I think I can cast this if I have to. 
Very well, I don't want to learn. I want to learn, but you must cast it on me. Teach me and I'll cast it on you. Uh, I want to learn it. I want to learn the curse, but I won't cast it on you. You need to cast it on me. I shan't forget this. Yeah, I don't want to cast... He's already done enough for us. Uh... There we go. We've now learned Crucio. Ready? I'm ready. Took that like a champ. Yeah. Uh, are you all right? Yeah, I got that potions. Way. I'm good. It was excruciating, but I'll survive. Let's Look at him. Moving. He's just back there like, what the heck we just happened? <laughs> we found Salazar Slytherin's scriptorium. Oh, Revelli. I can't believe we're here. Salazar Slytherin Scriptorium, a secret and well-protected room beneath Hogwarts where Salazar Slytherin appears to have spent time making various long-term plans with respect to the student population and reflecting on disagreements he had with other founders. Dude looks really... that's a sick statue. Sebastian, ominous. There's a book just here. You found something. It's a spell you book. go ahead. Let me know what's in it. I'll wander around a bit. Big chest for no reason. Revelio. I fear we shall never come to an accord. I cannot persuade even one of them to listen to reason. His diary. His diary. Oh, yes, it tastes wonderful. Oh, another chest. Leather winter cloak. What do you think? Looks like a spell book of some kind. This is incredible. A Hogwarts founder's possession. What an honor. Still can't believe Ominous never told me about his aunt and what she found. What will you do with Slytherin's spell book? What I do with every book. Read it. Having professors as parents ingrained that habit early on. But I can do that later. For now, I say we explore this room. Okay. It's breathtaking. I've been getting an uneasy feeling about this place. Revelio. I don't All want right. to leave, but I owe you. Both of you. Oh no. Without both of you, we'd never have made it this far. Okay, we now how we could have died. We must swear never to do this again. Travel. See a way out. Best news I've heard all day. Ominous. About your aunt. Please, Sebastian. I meant what I said before. We swear, right now, never to engage in anything to do with dark magic again. Understood. I'm truly sorry about your aunt, Ominous. I suppose after all this, I am grateful to know what happened to her. Thank you. And that quest is now done in the shadow of the study. That was a very cool quest. I, I actually really enjoy it. And now we can travel down there if we ever need to. We did just learn Crucio right here. Let's see, what does this do? Causes most enemies to writhe in pain as they take damage over time. Also curses the victim and cursed enemies take extra damage. Nice. Uh, we'll put that here. All right, what to do next?